Hello everyone, today I'm going to be filming my Pan That Palette Challenge for 2017. Sorry that it is extremely dark. It's probably like 3 or 4 o'clock at night right now, but I wanted to hurry up and film this. And with my room lights on, it was just so off and all those kind of things. So I hope you can see the palette's good. So let's just get into it. So I picked two palettes. One I use pretty much almost all the time and I've already hit pan. Um, it's going to be the Naked Basics palette. And this is here so far. So I've hit pan on WOS. And then I have a little bit of a good divot in the Naked 2. That's what I use in the crease. And I actually use this pretty much almost all the time if I'm just going for a quick, simple look. Um, the one that's going to be the hardest probably in this palette is going to be the black. And then even so, Venus, because I don't use it too much unless I'm maybe doing um, the inner corner or something. So that's going to be this one. But since it's a smaller one, I'm also going to add in something else that has a little bit more color in it. And this one is also Urban Decay and honestly I'm just doing it to get rid of it because of the packaging. I hate trying to open this thing. Urban Decay as well in this little tin. I don't even know what this palette is because I think I threw out the little casing that it sat in because that was just a pain in the butt to take out as well. So this is what it looks like. So it has gorgeous colors in it. I have actually used this since the beginning of the year since um, I decided that I wanted to start panning this one. So I thought it was, you know, a great choice. But like I said, the only thing I don't like about it is the, the tin closure. It's just kind of hard to open. So it's just not something that's, you know, convenient and easy. So those are my two palettes that I'm going to try and pan for the entire year. This is just going to be a really quick video. I don't have too much to say about it. I mean, I've never done a year-long pan challenge before. Um, so I think it's definitely going to be difficult because I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes. But I think definitely this one here, I'm hoping to finish up and even with the black I'm hoping to finish up but as long as I can make a really good dip by the end of the year I'll be happy with this and then this one here just with the colors I don't do colors too too often but you know I am hoping to be able to get through a lot of these the blue might be the most difficult in this one but as long as I can hit pan on every single shadow maybe not make it completely <laughs> empty like some of the other girls do I'm not sure if I'm that skilled yet and committed um, but I just want to hit pan on every single color in this one and then I do want to completely finish up this one and hopefully I can get through the black um, I don't do black too too much so I'll, I'll have to start uh, but that's it guys um, probably going to do an update either maybe four times a year, three times a year, or maybe just halfway through. Not sure I, how I feel or what my prog progress will be, but that is it. If you are doing this challenge, let me know so I can watch your video and, you know, watch your progress along the way. But have a wonderful day, guys. See ya.